Hi, and welcome back to Ty's Corner. Today, I wanna to show you a simple circuit that um, we can do using a paper clip, a light bulb, and a D-cell battery. It doesn't have to be a D-cell battery. You can use any battery as you like, um, but you know, make sure it's a small little bulb because it doesn't require a lot of power to run. So what I'm going to do first is take this paper clip and actually unravel it. So now that I have an unraveled paper clip, what I'm going to do is um, actually try and keep this battery standing so it doesn't fall and I can keep, apply a little pressure. So what I wanna make sure I'm doing is making sure that this um, is connected to the bottom terminal of the battery. Okay, so I'm going to take my light bulb and if you notice on the bottom of this light bulb, we have like this little metal cap and that is what we want to touch our paper clip with. And that's what's going to send the current um, through to that little cap and hopefully light up this um, battery. And I don't mean it like this, it's not gonna light up because this actually has to be attached to this battery. And the way I'm going to do that today is just simply touching it, like laying it on the uh, top of the battery and then just simply touching the uh, paper clip to that metal piece. So let's see if it's gonna work. It's not working. Hold on a second. Like I said, I have to make sure everything up. Oh, there it goes. Okay. So you have to just make sure, you know, everything It's a little difficult to do by one person, but if you have a partner, it'd be so much easier. So one person can actually hold on to the battery while the other person can try and connect the two together. So that is how um, to make a simple circuit. Now, what's the science behind this? Well, the, um, there are electrons within the battery because um, it, you know, it has potential electrical energy. And those electrons are going to flow through the paper clip. The paper clip is a metal paper clip and um, it's known as a conductor. So it can easily transfer um, electrons from one to another, sorry. Yep. There we go, That's hopefully it stays in place. So what happens is those electrons are flowing through the circuit to the positive end of the battery. And um, when I touch this light bulb, it will light up. Anyway, that is how to make a uh, simple circuit. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to give this video a big thumbs up and a like, and I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family, so please subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.